Hi, you guys. My name is Crystal. I work with MWR Community Recreation and MWR Liberty Program. I wanted to take the time on behalf of the Community Recreation team to say thank you for supporting us through our new changes as we take our activities and programming virtual. It's something new to all of us and we greatly appreciate your support. With that being said, if you guys have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out. Our office number is 760-339-2559 or you can reach us here on Facebook through Messenger. With that being said, today we have our pizza bite recipe. It's a simple recipe. It takes no more than 20 minutes and I hope you guys enjoy and stay safe. Bye. Hi guys, so today I'm gonna to teach you how to make pizza bites and they're very simple. Um, you need some marinara sauce, some cheese, um, some, uh, you could either use biscuits or crescent rolls. Today I'm using biscuits, um, but I usually use the crescent rolls. And pepperoni. So my pepperoni is always two. They're usually big. I get the small ones, so I cut them in half. And then with the biscuits, these part in half really easily. So I tear them apart and I stretch them out. I put marinara sauce and I just go around. And then I get the pepperoni and I place it down. You can put as much or as little as you want. This is an easy snack to make um, if you're in the mood for something quick. it into a little fold it in half into a little taco and then you're just gonna press it in and bunch it and bunch it and press it in and again just keep doing that till you get a little bone and then you place it in your little oven tray and then you repeat the steps With the little pieces, you add less so that they won't fluff out um, with everything in them. I made sure to preheat my oven at 375. That way, I'm gonna cook these at 375. You just repeat the process. Um, this should make about 10 small pizza bites. And again, all you do is just fold. And we'll be back. Once they're all ready, I'm gonna go ahead and place them in my little oven. And I'm gonna start the timer for 15 minutes. 
here they are all ready to go out of the oven as you can see this one broke a little on me but they're very delicious <laughs>